providing nutrition, particularly to the young ones, in providing food on the table of families and um, in making life more affordable. And um, that is on its way. And uh, of course, it cannot come soon enough. So there is, uh, uh, the, 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 the granaries have been opened up. The reserves have been opened up. Food distribution is underway. In addition to that, as we know, we have revamped. We have revamped the direct payments to individuals in order to cover 75 million Nigerians at the end of the day. And that process has now has integrity, has transparency and visibility. And it's just a question of speeding it up, scaling it up. Uh, we know that before it wasn't what it should have been and it was stopped in the interest of uh, 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 integrity. But now funding is being rolled out that will allow people to take money, go to the market and buy. And at the same time, of course, there is tremendous focus on food production. I think that is the key area to, to, to focus on now um, because the economy has been changed, has been put on track, but people must feel it and they must feel it soon. We understand that. And Mr. President is very, very aware of that and committed to that. He's a man of the people. He's from the grassroots. Thank you very much. And finally, before I let you go, Honorable Minister, thank you for your time. What's the message to Nigerians on a day like this as the Minister of the Economy? I think the message is that there is hope of better days to come and in, in the very, very near future. Uh, we are on the right track. We have turned the economy around and now the benefits are about to be felt by Nigerians. That's the commitment and that's necessary. That is what must happen and we realize that under the leadership of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu. Thank you. Thank you very much, Honorable Minister.